And while it's not that uncommon for NHL players to have four names, such as Devontae smith pelly or Ryan Nugent Hopkins, who both have a first, middle, and then two last names, but when it comes to Oliver Ekman Larson, he's in a category of his own, as he not only has two last names, but also a pair of middle ones. Reciting the defenseman's full name is quite a mouthful, as it is legally Oliver Oscar Emanuel Ekman Larson. One can only wonder if his parents even tried to recite the five names when he was in trouble as a child. Speaking about his parents, Ekman Larson was exceptionally close to Mother Annika, who passed away last year in 2017, after an ongoing 10-year battle with cancer. But Oliver has still been left with many fond memories, while even crediting his mom for his success. She got me skating when I was a kid, and when I didn't like it at first, she kept pushing me. Ekman Larson says. Annika attended all of his games while he played in Sweden, even showing up after treatments while she could. I don't think she ever missed a game, he says. Even if she wasn't there, she was at home, watching it on her computer. And even after she was gone later that year, he would play for her once more. Ekman Larson was a key contributor in Sweden taking home gold in the World Championships, and even planned to take his medal to her gravesite in memoriam. I played for my mom, she's the reason I decided to finish the season with Team Sweden, and I'm really happy that I did. She meant so much to me and was a big part of everything I've been doing for my whole life. I'm playing hockey because she loved it. That's why I want to bring the medal to her and show her. Even though Oliver is one immensely talented defenseman, he may not be the only Ekman Larson suiting up for the Coyotes for much longer, as his younger brother Kevin, who is also a defenseman, is currently playing for the Tucson Roadrunners, which is Arizona's AHL affiliate. The younger Ekman Larson recently joined the team officially last season, but unlike his brother, he's not as offensive and tends to stay closer to home while making defensive plays. Even still, I think many will admit that they're hoping to see the two bros playing side by side on ice. And if having a brother as a defenseman wasn't enough, being a defenseman in the Ekman family goes back for generations, as Oliver's maternal grandfather Kenneth also played for Team Sweden as a defenseman in 1972, 45 years before his grandson would take home the gold medal for their home country. So besides just being talented in hockey, this blue liner is multifaceted when it comes to sports. During an interview with Paul Bissonnette, Eggman Larson admits to playing both soccer and tennis in high school. Tennis was probably my favorite sport, he says, and if I would have stuck with it, I would be pretty good at it. I guess we'll never know. Even still, I'm sure most of you are glad he stuck with hockey instead.